what I'm reviewing is a movie title. I'm trying to remember the title at the moment. I'm, it's late, okay? Mm, I am. Um, <laughs> uh. I'm, this will be my last video for today. After this one. I'm reviewing a movie called, uh... The searching my mind, waiting for it to come to me, any moment now, mind. This is my review on all the trilogy. Of Lord of the Rings. Uh, I give this a 0 out of 10 because I can't tell what the fuck is going on in the story. I'm serious. These movies are poorly edited together. It's hard to make out what's going on in the story. All three of them. And one of them, I think, has, like, five endings. When I say it has five endings, I mean it ends five times a row in the movie. After scene, after a certain scene ends. You think the end credits are going to come, but no. There's more end. And that just pissed me off. I think that was the third one, though. Another thing I thought was stupid about the sequel called The Two Towers or, or The Twelve Towers, something like that. Lord of the Rings is two, I'm going to call it. I thought it was kind of stupid how nobody wanted to save Gandalf, the, uh, the, 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 nobody wanted to save the wizard. Uh, and just let the wizard die to his doom. Any is am I the one that was strange? How like uh, the guy that's carrying the ring in the trilogy, you know, the whiny main character, what's his name? I forget his name. Was his name Frodo? Or yeah, I think he sucks. Like, he doesn't really grow that much as a character. I thought he was underdeveloped. I mean, he started okay in the first one. But it was... He... he no, he was whining in the first one, even, come to think of it. I was just making a mistake thinking that he was going to grow out of that whiny habit. Of a personality. And he's also kind of punchable by the end of the trilogy. Is this that his every sentence feels like a line a minute of a sentence? Like he's giving Chris O'Donnell's run for his money. Chris O'Donnell's Robin from Batman Robin. He's giving him a run for his money <laughs> in this trilogy of Lord of the Rings. That's how much of whiny Frodo is. Character. And he's the main character. He gets the main screen time. We have to listen to his bland ass. He's as bland as the cast from the last Airbender movie. From back in 2010 remake. I mean, before 2000, Netflix, before Netflix remake happened. Look, 
Let me rephrase my sentence, okay? So scratch everything I said. My need to rephrase my joke, okay? Frodo's as whining as bland as the characters from the last Airbender movie from 2010. That N.A. Shamblon put out and made. That's a terrible character he is. I... I do not like him. And that's why I give the Lord of the Rings trilogy a 0 out of 10. From the first one to the last one. The third installment. That's my trilogy review on Lord of the, Lord of the Rings and why I'm giving it a 0 out of 10. 0 out of 10 I give them. Okay, and if you like this video, hit the thumbs up. And for those who want to subscribe to my channel, hit the subscribe button, then hit the bell to subscribe. You have to hit both in that order. Uh, goodbye and good night. That's my review on Lord of the Rings.